We know they've got quality, we know they're a good team and we know they hold a two-goal advantage. But if we sit back and we concede, then we obviously haven't executed our game plan correctly. We know we need to score two goals to try and get through this tie, three goals to try and get through, two to equalise. But uh, we know they're a good team, so we've got to keep the back door shut. So um, I've made the boys aware of our, our minds going into the game and hopefully you'll see it tomorrow from the first whistle. We built some confidence uh, against LA and now we're going into uh, a fantastic game, a uh, semi-final uh, in the Champions League uh, against a good team and we're looking forward to getting after them. We've said all along that we believe in our ability to score goals. Uh, we proved it on, on Saturday that uh, we're able to do that uh, and, and I, I think we're going to prove that it's going to be able to, to score goals against the Tigers as well. Uh, I don't know if, if we're easily going to score two or three. It's going to take a lot of hard work because they are a good team, but we're looking forward to the challenge, and I believe uh, fully that we can go and win it. From the first half, we have to rush and try to, to score the quickest possible, but because um, if we score earlier, we know that um, at any time, any stage of the game, we, we could uh, run for the other goal. We are thinking in a final, so this can make us go into the World Cup um, in clubs, so it's huge. We want to make history and hopefully we could make the first step tomorrow. We are trying to jump into the field and believing that one goal is going to give us a push or the plus that we need to keep going for the second one. Yeah, you're always going to play in the edge, you know, that danger zone. Um, even if we're winning 2-0, we know that one goal is going to uh, be tough to come back. But uh, this is soccer, and that's, that's the beauty of the game. You never know what's going to happen in 90 minutes.